our spotlight in the room. Morgan Dark Carnival Expo continues with an old friend of Morning Live of CHCH. Actually, a very important piece of history. I'm sorry, Mitch, I just called you a piece of history. Oh, my God. Look how good you're looking. You <laughs> called our coach this morning, too. Wow, we coordinate. Yeah, and that was an accident. I didn't well, plan that. Mitch Markowitz, the guy responsible for one of the greatest moments in this station's 60-year history, House of Frankenstein, is a cavalcade of stars, grew up watching that show that you created. Oh, my God. Bob, you do the best intro in, <laughs> in the industry. You really do. Uh, thank you. And, and You have I'm, the best suits in the industry. Well, thank you, and I'm so happy to be there. I have to pet you. I'm sorry. But what <laughs> about the shoes? Do we have a wide shot? I got, Get the I, shoes. I've got to show the shoes. Every dollar's in the screen, Mitch. <laughs> but uh, no, uh, I know Mike Myers. Uh, talked about watching it on CHCH in, in his formative years, but yeah. uh, many others, Jim Carrey. Not only did he talk about it, he told when he was given the key to the city by the mayor, he yeah. told the assembled crowd that um, he came home every day after school, paid a plate of cookies, a glass of milk, and watched Frankenstein. And 50 years, 40 years later, whatever it was, Minnie Me, Maxie Me, Austin Powers, yeah. Mm -hmm. That was very nice. And it still resonates today, hence the lineups of the room are I can feel it resonating carnival. now. Yes, yeah. but uh, I mean, you appear at various shows, including the one we're going to tell you about coming up at the Hamilton Convention Center this weekend, because fans just, you know, uh, again, there's such a nostalgia thing about it, but it was such a great show with well, great stars, including yourself. Well, thank you, Bob. That's very nice of you. I'm really looking forward to Dark Carnival, because the who's who of horror are going to be there. Speaking of the who's who, I have to thank you very much for the act that I had to follow today. You know, with the fork the, up the nose in the industry. That's they, show biz, Mitch. They say don't follow kids yeah. or, or dogs, but they never said anything about guys putting forks in their noses. Anyway, I just met them in the green room, and um, well, you've met many big stars. Of course, Vincent Price on the show. Uh, I mean, that and, and the great Billy Van. The great Billy Van, most talented guy I've ever worked with, Vincent Price. One of the nicest, most down-to-earth guys I've ever worked with. A really, really terrific soul. Oh, wait, I shouldn't say soul. I forgot. Tonight, I'm with Spooky Steph at the... Um, uh, uh, the Innards of Hamilton Place. Yes, a Haunted Evening, it's called, at Hamilton Place. And that's going to be one spooky night, I'll tell you. Yeah, there could be a paranormal experience. I certainly hope so. Yeah. But uh, Vincent Price, he was at CHCH for... A week, even though the show is still running today That's in true. North America, That's but true. Uh, it, it was it was uh, it was quite hectic in in that time. There was a story about the, the writers being camped in some mansion doing a, a rewrite. Yeah, and we, they were, we, we, you wouldn't let them out until they were finished. We, we came out to the site, uh, to the to the set, I should say, started shooting. Riff, my brother, was in the in the bus yeah. directing, and uh, we got about ten minutes into the shoot, and Riff gets on the PA and says, "Vincent, Mitch, we have to talk." And he came out, and we had a little huddle, and he looks Vincent in the eye and said, Vincent, you're just not scary. We hired you to be scary. Yeah. And Vincent looks him right back in the eye and said, Griff, you want scary, you have to write scary. Yeah. <laughs> Stuff you wrote was cute, it rhymed, but it yep. wasn't scary. Got the guys back in, locked them into a room, no toilet, no food, no nothing for yeah. 24 hours. Bang on the door. They were finished. We fed them, let them go to the bathroom. The rest is history. Then you had a show. Later, yeah. And for signing Vincent Price, that you know, you had a deal on the show. But did you know when you were making it, you would have something that would continue decades later and have such a fan base? Absolutely no idea whatsoever. Yeah. I mean, we thought we were going to do 130-hour-long episodes. It would run here at CHCH. Uh, the the glowing star in the Golden Horseshoe would run for a year and then go to television heaven. And then we were all, and we are still yeah. completely shocked, 45 years later, yeah. longest running kids TV and show. And I know Canadian you're working history. on a documentary too, so that's a good excuse to have you back uh, as you capture that great oh, that, history. So but nice you can meet the man this weekend, the Rue Morgue Dark Carnival Expo is at the Hamilton Convention Center, Saturday and Sunday. Be there all with day. many featured guests. Thanks, Mitch. Great to see you again. My we'll pleasure. see you good after this fast break. Okie doke.